Hello guys and welcome to Crafty Fox Blue. Today we're going to be building Annie and Clarabelle from Tom's Friends. So uh, this is what they look like. They are Thomas's coaches that he uses on his branch line. And uh, when I did the Thomas tutorial, I asked if people were interested in uh, Annie and Clarabelle as a tutorial. And a lot of people said actually yes. So uh, yeah, we're going to be building them today. And uh, the main difference between Annie and Clarabelle is not much. It's just like one window here is uh, filled in. And this is supposed to be a break compartment for luggage and a guard, so on both sides. It's just filled in this window here. And that is pretty much the main difference between it. And I guess the only difference. And usually when you're pulling this, you will have Annie uh, facing towards Thomas and Clarabelle facing towards the back. Uh, but anyways, let's get started. So the first thing we're going to do, we take out the materials. First, we'll take out another brick slab. Nether brick fence, nether brick wall, nether brick, uh, let's see. Yeah, that's about it for nether brick. Wither skeleton skull, um, and this orange terracotta, uh, gray concrete, hopper, dark oak fence gate. All right, so first off, we're gonna place the coupling down. So that's gonna be a nether brick fence, two blocks above the tracks that and by the way this is the 1.5 to 1 scale version of it should have said that before and we're gonna make the nether brick slabs behind it five blocks wide and then we'll go here on the side and we're gonna make this part three blocks long so one two and three add another brick wall like that and we'll do the same thing on the other side another brick wall then we're gonna add in another brick slab right after the wall and then we're going to add another wall in then we're going to add in five nether brick slabs so one two three four and five one two three four five and then add another brick walls both sides nether brick slab and then a wall and then three slabs so one two three one two three connect the ends together Add in that nether brick fence in the middle with their skeleton skulls on uh, the edge. Alright, next up we'll go uh, on the inside of this there's going to be a nether brick uh, block on the inner part of uh, this slab I guess here in the middle. So just add that both sides and add in a gray concrete underneath. Hopper to the side and a dark oak fence gate facing towards the hopper on both sides. I do the same thing on the other side. And then we can add in another brick slab in the middle of the wheels and another one at the top. Alright, and then we're going to do the same thing for the other wheel, just pretty much rebuild it right over here with another brick block. Next to slab, add in the wheels, which are gray terracotta, I mean gray concretes. Nether brick slabs and then hoppers to the sides with dark oak fence gates facing towards it on both sides. Alrighty, so after we're done with that, I think we're just going to fill in the floor in. So that's pretty much easy, just nether brick slabs all the way across the hole that we left. Alright, and after we're done with that, Let's see, we're gonna take out this orange terracotta. We're gonna add it a border around the perimeter of this. So the whole thing just pretty much make a border all the way, wrap that around all the way across. All right, and then for the face, we're gonna add in an upside down T shape, the orange like that. I guess it's like a pyramid now. And then we're going to add in this uh, smooth red sandstone stairs. It's going to be right side up. And then two upside downs at the top. Other side will do the same thing. So you got room for the little window here and then the eyes. And the inside of the eyes, we're going to fill that in with black concrete. Bam and bam. Like that. 
All right, so next up, let's go on the other end. So the other end's pretty much blank, except for like these two windows. So like two by three, orange like that. And add in our stairs right on the edges. Both sides, the red sandstone stairs. All right. Then we'll go on the side here and we can add in some of these uh, red sandstone stairs. So there's gonna be three of them facing towards the middle and then upside downs. Other side, same thing. So one, two, three, one, two, and three. Then I'm gonna add in the orange two block stall like that. And then another three, three by two of these stairs. And then orange, two blocks tall. And we'll go on the other side and do it the same thing, just towards the middle, three of them like this. Then add a pillar. And then three more. And this should be the last section of these windows that we're making. Now on the inside of all these windows, there's gonna be a smooth quartz block. So just fill in the inside of all these windows. So that they are, I guess, whited out. Usually they would be blacked out, but in Thomas's case, it is actually whited out according to the actual um, model series. All right, so after we have completed that, uh, you can also change up this window right over here next to like the eyeball, I guess, to uh, black concrete. If you wanna just make it look, you know, neater, I guess. That's what I did, cause I felt like it would be kinda weird. It's like half uh, black and then half white. So I just made that black. All right, so now we'll go make the face, the nose, that's gonna be red sense the wall in the middle with a dark oak button underneath for a little lip. And then on the sides here, we'll add in uh, smooth stone slabs, every other block, and this goes all the way across the side here. And we'll do the same thing on the other side. All right, and then we'll add in this polished diorite wall, I mean stairs, all the way across the edges here. And then we'll add in our orange, it's gonna be three blocks wide. Just uh, two blocks inside for both ends. That, and we'll add in our smooth sandstone, I mean, our smooth stone slabs, three blocks wide at the edges. Could be an upper block like that. And then the rest, it should just be that smooth stone slabs all the way across the roof. all the way across okay so after we're done with that we can add in our light gray carpet three blocks wide on top is orange both sides like that all right and then we're gonna go here on the side here it's gonna be three blocks wide of these uh, birch buds in the middle you can see right there in the center and the other side will do the same thing it's gonna say Andy or Clarabelle all right, so next up, we're gonna add in these little iron bars. Now, if you're using um, the default without using World Edit or Debug Stick, you know it's gonna hover a little bit, but that's really the best you could do. You're just gonna place this in the middle of all of these windows like that. Okay, so I just put in the middle window, iron bar. I guess it's like a door handle or something like that. All right. So after we've done that, uh, we can add in our wither skeleton skull. I don't know why I didn't add this before, but we're gonna add that in the bottom corners like that. And we'll go on the other side and apparently I already did that there. Okay, so uh, yeah, that's how you make uh, Annie. Now to make Clarabelle, it's very, very easy. You're just gonna build it 180 degrees the other direction and it's the same exact model. It's just like you fill in these two windows here so you'll go here pretend this is Clarabelle you're making it you're just gonna fill in this window here with the orange terracotta like that and yeah that's pretty much it on how you make the twin coaches in Minecraft for uh, Thomas the Tank Engine and um, 
yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you do, hit the like button down below and subscribe if you haven't already because I'll be uploading more videos in the future. And I will see you guys in the next one.